Hello everybody and welcome back to our next episode of DKC3 Dixie Kong Double Trouble Dixie Kong's Double Trouble, that is plural Possessive She's, she's possessed And so am I On this day Because we are getting things done and ready As we are near the end we are in the second to last world, the penultimate world, quote unquote, wink wink, of DKC3, Razor Ridge. Let's go, and we're ready, because we put in the 50 lives code. We have 50 lives on our hands, so we should not get a game over, because I am determined to get this shit done. We're close to being done. We're getting there. Let's do it to... Buzzer Barrage, and bro, this is definitely one of the hardest levels in the game. We are bumping that difficulty. That's another reason why we're having the 50 lives. All you have to do is the LRR, 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 LRR thing at the main menu, and you put in the lives code, just L-I-V-E-S. You spell that out, that's the code for it. 50 lives. We're back to our original colors. It's still Christmas time, but... That was only for that good old Winter Wonderland episode previous. And you know why it starts off hard? Because we're starting off with this purple fuck. Oh man, we're back. Here we go. Here we go. We are... Dark Squawks. As I like to call them. The infamous Squawks. Anything in the corner? Nothing. Okay. The reason why this level's freaking hard is because the checkpoint. Like, this level is long as shit. So let's get through it the first try. And you got those helicopter fuckers. That will definitely ruin your day. Uh. Since we can't shoot, I was trying to find a barrel, but there might be one back here. Down below. Yep. For this hoe. Oh! That sucks. I think that was a DK barrel, too, but we got hit at the same time. So there we go, just to show off, I have 50 lives now. I don't think you can put it in again and get max lives. I am not sure about that, honestly. But yeah, you have to, like, get that in order to have Dixie. So yeah, th th I've mentioned before the hardest difficulty to 105% this game. We're in normal difficulty, we ain't doing that shit. What that consists of is no halfway marks at all, so this level will be 10 times harder. So we die anywhere, it's over. We have to restart the entire level. But there's also no DK barrels to refill your lives. So that sucks. Is he gonna come? Oh my god. Thank you. I think we have to go this way. It's also a maze. How amazing. Don't hit me. Thank you. But there are certain areas in the game where they have to give you the Kong. There's another level in this world that does that, where I'll show. Where they will give you a DK barrel somewhere in the middle of the level. Because other than that, it's literally impossible to continue. So there's some le leeway that they give you in the 105% completion of toughest. Oh. Gotta get these barrels, man. Ah! You don't touch me! I don't wanna be touched. Ugh. Especially in the butt. Alright. Ow! Oh! Wrong movement. Let's do it again. Throw it at him. Oh! That's great. Let's do it again. It takes down here. And this. Fuck. Get away from him. I wanna... I just wanna drop it. Thank you. That's what I've been trying to do. For the bee. Bash the baddies. We failed the level once, and now we failed the... That. Once. The bonus. I think that was the last one, too. Mmm. Let me just turn my ass on you. Oh my god. 
I should have. I, I should. Yeah. There's a lot of things I should have done, but I didn't do. Oh, we can speed run back there. Oh! Red B blocked me. There we go. Super, super squawks. Super fast squawks. Do it this time for realsies. All the other times didn't mean shit. Oh, I hit the B anyways. I, I hit A, B. There we go. There we go. Fast grab. Turn my ass on ya. Oh, shit. Yeah, just gonna drop it on him. That time. There you go. There might be one more. There might be one more B. And now we're at 53. <laughs> Bonus coins. Alright. So now we can get through that. There's nothing else up here. Alright, yeah, that's right. Okay. Let's take our time a little bit. Just a little bit. Because these guys will just run into you out of nowhere. Are we going to do the DK barrel already? That lasted. it. Still kegs last. It's really not much of a defense mechanism with this barrel with these guys either. But we do need this. There we go. It's trying to speed up the speed the movement of that barrel that barrel roll nice 51 lives no way and now we gotta get in between these fucks see this is just the first half of the level we're not even at the halfway mark yet still please okay yeah just turn that ass on him oh boy oh boy we're not waiting. Okay, there it is. Oh my god! Why did I check there? Why am I checking corners? Fuck me. Would you fucking move it? Thank you. Nice. Fucking nice. Fucking. Fucking A. Oh, I did the jump. I did that fucking Donkey Kong 2 jump. You know which one. God damn it. I swear it feels like I can make that. God damn it. I think we just go under him. I guess it'd be more impressive to do that jump with Dixie in a way. Okay, we're going to get hit there anyway, so it doesn't matter. Hey, don't grab it again. Let it go. Yeah, you gotta avoid those guys so they won't even pop the barrel either. Because we need the barrel. It's another challenge. Oh my god! Slow piece of shit. I think that's why it's impressive, because he kind of stuns her. I don't think you can do it with Dixie. Because it's just the animation is off. Yeah, whatever. Oh, sh oh boy. Already with editing. Wow, we just fucking passed that up. Fuck, I forgot about that. Shit! Would you stop missing the fucking barrel? Please. Uh, I don't want to go that way. 
Oh my god. So fast. And that's too slow. Oh, whoa. It's me. <laughs> Would you fucking jump? Ah, don't grab it again! Oh, <laughs> Stop fucking missing that shit. I want it. Back to the squawks route. Screech's sprint, y'all. It's back! Oh fuck you! If I would have just taken the hit, if that was the case, eat my ass! Eat my ass! It's definitely a delay jumping after teaming up with Dixie when you have that fat ass on you. I could have sworn I had to just go under that guy, but I guess we're good enough to go up to the top. Oh, if we don't miss that. I'll take it. I don't know where the K is, but we'll take it. Oh, if we stop missing this, that'd be nice. Think speed run, you want to fucking take the hit there because that's too slow to be waiting. And you have to go to the top. It's just I was going too fast, I guess. I don't know. I thought bottom route was the best route. And then we're just trying to speed run back, dude. That's all. Kitty Kong's too fat to be doing the 2 1 jump like that. I had control before to get that. Let's about this one. Yeah, I'm gonna just take the hit. Fuck it. There we go. We're back, guys. That's all you needed to do. Holy shit! All the fucking bees, bruh. All the fucking bees right here, man. Oh, shit. I wanted that bear coin. I knew that was there. So, yeah, this, honestly, the second half is on. Oh, my God. Is the hardest part of the level. We were just speedrunning through the first part. Per first part wasn't really that hard. This is where it gets real. So yeah, imagine speedrunning this, we just might as well take a fucking hit. So there's stuff up here. Very tough stuff. Still keg. Hit him. Another one spawns. Hit him. Another one spawns. We'll take it. That's how we get our DK coin. Bounce off that. Bam, got him. There you go, that's all right there. It's all right there. Don't spawn back. Alright, come back up. I know you're coming to. Yeah, you are. If that killed me, the fucking hit range on that is ridiculous. And it already is. But man, my god. Okay, we're gonna need this, it seems like. Again, don't get hit by him. Also, don't... Let him hit the barrel and destroy it. There we go. Could just went straight in the middle, but I want to make sure all the bees were gone so I could actually get it. Oh, another one's right here. Well, whatever. Got a second chance. Oh, he almost did. Red bee's trying to protect him. Whoa! Get away. All right. Here we go. Speed runs are definitely impressive. Nothing up there. Cool game. Cool. 
get rid of you. I don't even care what's up there, because that's just where you stop. Only- oh my god. That guy always gets me, because they just pop out of nowhere, dude. They really do at times, so you gotta really take your time. But yeah, that's the only DK barrel they'll give us to replenish our lives. So, talk about going back into Mechanos. This is fucking Logi Labyrinth all over again. Damn near. With the whole squawks part. I didn't even get the K. That's the only thing we were missing is the K. I don't know where that K is. I'm sorry. We're supposed to do everything in this game. Oh, well, there's one, the last one. This is the real last one. There we go. Bait this guy over. What sucks is the end. Ouch. What the fuck happened there? I got an extra hit. That was a glitch, guys. Welcome to my channel where all the first things happen. Right here. And that's cool, because we just got through that. But this part, you want to bounce off this fucker's head at the very fucking end for the last bonus. Second and last. Collect 40. And you gotta do it again off this guy. That's the theme of this mini game. So we're gonna use Kitty Kong because he's bigger. Literally. That's the strat. He has a bigger hitbox. Just like in the waterfalls. There we go. There we go. We are out of this level, guys. Holy shit. Am I glad. And there's nothing else up there. Just that fucker. Nothing. Alright, let's go. It's over. I don't know how we got that extra hit, dude. That, that, that was invisible barrel. But it's done. We can save it now. I love how they're giving us Wrinkly Kong after the first level for each of these. I'm on my last life and you're breaking my concentration. So we have to be quiet while you're playing the game and while you're sleeping. Cool. So we only, yeah, got one more item left. We were at, we were exactly at the three hour mark, by the way. So that took 18 minutes of in-game time to do. Don't worry, you got your goodbye kiss, Wrinkly. We love you. Since this is the last time we're going to see you. And by that, I mean in this game. So Benny's chairlifts. What's up, Benny? Good day, Crazy Kongs. My name is Benny. Me and my brother Bajorn run the chair. My lift will never break down. You can be sure of that. Or a bit. Would you like to be using the chairlift? Er, okay. Hell yeah. Strap yourself in, and away you go. Let's go. I had a little creature of mine. A little plushie, you can say, named Benny. He was technically from Sesame Street, so it's pretty cool. Uh, but Kong-fused cliffs, haha, <laughs> Kong-fused. As you can also notice, uh, you see the chairs moving. All you have to do to go back is wait for them right here. But of course we're going to keep moving forward. But as you see up at the top, you have chair lifts that aren't moving. And he mentioned someone named Bajorn, so maybe after this level we can figure that out. So, oh yeah, we are climbing a rope that's on fire. It's like dynamite it's gonna to reach to the top and we're gonna explode so yeah there's extra stuff so we can do there's the K in this level what do you know oh and these fuckers are back I don't know if there's stuff over to the right I don't want to risk that just yet because we, we could do that we can oh my god there was another one right there and I didn't even know about it and we're sliding off of the mountain yay Burn your rope, baby. Here we are. This majestic level. I guess we can explore a little bit more since we're Dixie and we can fly. But yeah, they come out of nowhere once again. We're going to have to try to avoid that. Along with that bee who's in a hurry. Want that K. Want to stay on this side because I know about this guy coming. There's bananas. Nothing. Cool. I gotta remember that. There's nothing over on that side. I grabbed the other rope on accident. Oh my god. So we're gonna have to go on this side now. Because that's the end of that rope. Short notice. Definitely short notice. 
on all this crap. Okay, there's bananas over there. Oh my god, I was trying to jump over there. I see the bonus at the very top right corner of the screen. Fucking jumped into the bee instead. That's why we want Dixie. But the thing is, even if we get here, we can't switch on a rope. We are stuck on a rope, dude. Climbing upwards to victory. Even though we're going to go downwards once we're done with this level. So it makes sense. But hey, man. Razor Ridge. We're in the mountains. Mountain part. Of everything. Oh, yeah. I love this level. I love the music. Just like uh, the previous level. Oh. I've been thinking about that music a lot. Oh, my God. So you gotta slow down. You don't wanna. I mean, you can stay down here. You ain't really gonna hit that as long as you keep moving a little bit. You don't wanna move all the way up to the top, like I'm doing right now. Oh my god. See, and then you got Nana's there, indicating you know you can get this bonus with either Kitty or Dixie by flying or jumping. And it's pretty cool. Don't go too fast. That's that's the thing with this. There we go. Before the fucking fire burns your ass. We, we literally have fire about to come up our butts. Bam. I know all the secrets and already halfway mark. That's the thing with these levels. Nice little shortcut, sort of. Ugh, gotta move though. See, and they make you move fast on certain areas, but then you have to slow down, otherwise you got those hel helicopter poppers like those guys. That's the only way to avoid that guy, was that barrel. Ugh. Wow, that was nice. I'm glad there was a DK barrel there. They knew about that. You just gotta trust your instincts and jump. What the fuck was that, dude? That's the thing that makes this level bullshit, honestly. And then you fucking try to look over there to see if there's anything and there's nothing. It's always the second half of these levels, dude. Always. Alright, doing it again. 42 lives. Lost a good eight of them. I lost more than that because we kept kept gaining some, but I mean, out of the fifty, yeah, it's all memory game. That's all it is. I want to stay here for a little bit as long as I can. Oh my god. I don't know how I was supposed to avoid that, other than going to the left, you know. Oh my god. Alright. Alright. Thank god. Okay, there's the last bonus. I trusted the bananas. You gotta trust in the bananas. Alright, okay, it's just back, left and right. Left and right. Left. Right. That's all it is. We're done. Good job, Kitty Kong. I am so proud of you. AKA Der Derpy Kong. That's how he gets his DK in it. KK. DK barrel. And I keep saying the barrel, because we're using a barrel to get the coin. The DK coin's at the very end. I'm not even going to trust what's left or right. There's nothing. Screw it. So now we're missing the O. Now we're going to miss the N in the next level. Then we're going to miss the G, and then we're going to get all three, all four of them. Yeah, all three of them. Stay on here, though. We have to get at the very top in order to do this. We have one shot. So he was underneath the whole time. That's only how you're going to get him to look up, obviously. And then there you go. Kitty Kong did it. No way. That surprised the fuck out of me. But now we can go up here. Bajorn's chair lifts. Here's Bajorn. Not just Benny. 
Oh, hello. How are you, my fine furry Kongs? I am being bajorn. I'm afraid that my chairlift is broken. I lent my number six wrench to someone and they didn't return it. Hey, you found my wrench. Could I have it back? Yes, it's yours anyways. So there's the wrench. That's what we needed the wrench for. Now we can use the ski lift for free from now on. No matter what. And this... Boom! Unlocks our banana bird for the episode. The cave of the bird. Let's go. Cliff top cache. Let's memorize. A. Y. B. Oh my god, I'm surprised, honestly. Because when I was naming it, I was like, I was just confusing myself more. I'm like, don't even name the buttons, because. Xbox, you know. Oh, we made it. Oh, we made it. We made it on the chairlift. Alright, so now... We move on into the Wada. Wada Kongs. In Floodlit Fish. Where we're in the deep, dark depth of hell. Oh, shush. It is dark as fuck. Oh, shush. So, yeah. We got on guard though, so in this one, we get to play as on guard the entire time. And what we have to do is poke these guys and make it a little bit lighter. Not too much brighter, but just a little bit. So, bam! Take that! And we can just keep hitting those and it'll refresh the time limit of how long it'll stay lit, fam. So, it's another good exploration level. I don't know about good, because it's sort of like a maze as well. But you definitely want to go around, check everything. Because it's like you don't know where you're going, we come in here, come back around, because that just looped around. One way leads to a dead end, so you gotta go back around and try to figure something else out, and all that good shit. Get away from me. And wow, bonus already. Collect 90 stars. Literally just swimming with On Guard. It's sort of like the World 3 one with the green bananas. But hey, we get to play as On Guard. So it's not really much of a challenge other than the time limit, but even then. Oh no, I'm missing one. What is it? There it is. We got it. We got it, I'm on guard. Look at me with my big nose. I'm related to Pinocchio. Ugh. Stab you with it. Ugh, take it. Alright. Then, of course. Oh my god. Get rid of these guys. Fuck those urchins. My biggest nemesis in the game, honestly. I want to refresh that time. Whee! Take it. So yeah, on guard, the only animal that has been into all three games. The entire trilogy. The only one. There's no other one. You can't name him. Not Rambi. Rambi was only in two and one. He got replaced by Ellie the Elephant. Squitter didn't make his appearance until DKC2, but I'm glad he's on this one as well. Technically, okay, Squawks, technically, is the other animal that's been on all three games. It's just Squawks in the first game was just, he was a, he was a small baby. He was just used for one level, just sort of like this level, where like you need the light in order to see. He was our guiding light to victory. But the mechanics of using him was only 2 and 3. So I kind of don't really count that. I want to see what else I missed. If there's any. Back this way. So I see that there. I want that banana. Oh, <laughs> shush. Give me that. Gotta get everything. Okay, it's not a banana. It's a fucking yellow fish. Alright, there's that. Alright, that's... All over here. Yep, just little extra secrets, some extra bananas. That's all. 
That's all we got over here. We move on now. So I know there's one that's like huge ass maze. Sort of. Where you have to find this bonus. I always manage to find it, but it's definitely possible to miss. Oh, double kill. Oh my god. Don't double kill me. Especially when it gets dark in here. I can't see shit. There you go. We're already halfway through the level. More than halfway now. Because we've been past that. That was unfair. I wonder why people think this game shit. I'll just keep bringing that debate up. Uh, where was this guy? I need light. He's up here, wasn't he? Yeah. That one's weird, because he's like flashing on and off. I don't know. You know what? Uh, I don't I don't know man I I, I don't know Hush. oh there's another one right there just get him out of here get him out of here go on knock him out Ugh. I didn't know I could push him away that far this is where it's dangerous because on guard will like to I mean it's overpowered but still we can get tranced in the middle of of the fucking hit and we'll get hit instead okay I don't know how smart that was alright well we found everything we didn't miss the end we'll miss it in the next level instead we'll get everything in the middle portions but yeah on guard he does his attack automatically if you get too close that's the thing with him so that's why I'm trying to keep my distance yeah, see, I'm not pressing the button. I'm not pressing anything right now. Now I'm pressing it. But now I'm not. See, it gets too close. Oh, I don't want you to do that. Because once they close, especially when I'm on top of them. Get rid of these fuckers! Yeah. Alright. Okay, see, we missed one. We missed a bonus. I know we did. Get out of here. It has to be somewhere up here. It's like straight dab in the middle. Or something. Yeah, right through these guys, probably. Ugh. There it is, yep. I knew it, I remember that much. It's not really too much of a maze, but still, just trying to do all that. Okay, so now we're just swimming with On Guard. This is like the Squawks Logi Labyrinth bonus, but just underwater and no slowdown or reverse controls of any sort. So that means... I feel like that means every yeah, everything respawned again. Cool. We're we'll gonna have to get at least rid of that guy. Alright, everything's done. Cool. Yeah, we need two Kongs and they give us the DK barrel at the fucking end. Alright. DK coins right here. Fuck. If that was our only chance. <laughs> oh wow. Look at us failing it. Ugh. Would you stop that? I'm just trying to stand on you. I keep doing it. It's not that hard. I'm just trying to be fancy. Oh, take that. Kitty is just wrecking everyone's shit this episode. He got three levels down. So now, pothole panic. Picnic. Gosh. This, guys... Literally welcome to the bonus world in DKC2 because it seems like we're doing it all once again. This is Animal Antics, pretty much. We're going to be playing as every single animal buddy along with the Kongs to help us out. And then we got this fucker throwing bombs. I don't think. Okay, never mind. They do hit you. Okay, either way, I thought you can get through them. But we have the green squawks. The good squawks. 
He won't physically hurt you, but the bombs, no matter what, will. Alright. And of course, these fuckers are back. I want that. Oh my god, they're on both sides. Of course. You don't see him on the other side. You seen the other guy. Whatever. But yeah, this one's pretty cool. I like this level. Bam, it's a box. There's a K. I think, yeah, I think the bird had the K in the previous, like the first level. And I'll forever get these bananas. Bananas for life. For Donkey Kong, baby. I mean, we're near the end of the entire trilogy, too. That's another thing to think about. Yeah, fuck you guys. Oh my god. You wanna do me that way? Oh, get out of here. Their hitbox is ridiculous. But yeah, these guys are the main villains of this world, and that's why the difficulty is definitely up now and forever. But other than like the first level, I mean the first level is alright, it's just it is pretty long. Oh my god! Get the fuck away from me! Fat ass birds fighting another bird. Alright, so that's it for squawks. Who do you think's next? Give you a hint. Starts with on guard. Oh sh We just used him too. Oh, at least we'll get hit like that. I need him back. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! I feel you, kitty. Whatever. <laughs> nice. Oh my god! You know what? We're restarting this. I'm gonna just completely miss that. Nice. Yeah, difficulty's definitely up there, y'all. I'm gonna hit you first and then get this and then just keep going. Speed run by getting everything, including the Kong levers and the bear coins. Assholes. Oh my god. The next level, I don't even think, like, for sure is not even that bad. This is like the final, like, tough level. But yeah, this is one of my favorite levels. Makes the world pretty, pretty good. Cause I love the music here, dude. I really love this music. I'm gonna get fucking hit again, cause I'm gonna try to get on guard. Well, it's kinda not the same. Cause I, I could've definitely got him regrouped, but wasn't letting me have it. Not letting me have it at all. That's what World 6 does to you. See, overpowered, bro. Overpowered. I'm really checking every corner in this game now. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. So look at that. Hit you anywhere, bro. Gonna go through all these motherfuckers, especially those guys. Okay, that was worth it. That's a little opening. And they're going back and forth so fast that you're nine times out of ten going to fucking actually hit them. There you go. Little crevices. Whoa, we went fucking under you. Park on guard right there real quick. Alright. Alright, yeah. Okay. Halfway mark with Ellie the elephant. I don't think yeah, we didn't miss anything so far, I don't think. That's just for that. We learned. Anything? 
Nope. That's cool. See, Kitty, Kitty's the, he's the star, man. He's the star. Nothing there. I ain't even risking that. Alright. And then bounce, uh, jump off of Ellie, because that's how you're going to get your bonus. This should be the first one. And they expect you to do it here, too. That should have been it. Like, the one before that, even. Thanks, Ellie. You're so helpful. You're the real star. Fuck Rambi. Oh, just... Not really. Because we're going to have to swim down here anyways, so that's it for Ellie. Didn't even get to really use her... Like water wise, but yeah, this is the DK barrel they will give you because, like, there's no way to get up there without team throwing. So, I mean, that's their decision. It's just, yeah, oh my god, the lag! Oh my god, worth it. Gotta get my squitter, dude. Need him. Don't waste them right there. We gotta go up. For our second and last bonus of the level. Great. Wow. Okay. That's how we're playing it? I guess that's how we're playing it. Also, if you get hit and he starts running into the sign, he will disappear and vanish. And you don't even get the bonus from it just a fucking puff of smoke and that's it all right question can he pick it up so I know you can like throw okay you can throw Dixie or kitty doesn't matter damn it's kind of tough then not really but it's just like it's slow But you can like throw one of the Kongs down and they can just sit there and pick up the bananas. I wish I I wish I had one of my Kongs to show that off. But we can do that in like a later one. Yeah, I'm gonna keep Squitter. That was good. Get, get me the fuck out of here, Dio. Keep your bombs. You damn barrel. That's, that should be the last barrel person we get to see. Alright. That's the end. Uh... Is it? I don't remember getting a DK coin. At all. Oh, you know why? Do you know why? I know where the fuck he is. Oh my god, we're gonna have to die. It's at the end, right here. It's right up there. You son of a bitch. We're, okay, we want to show that off then. With the bonus. Might as well do this, because we're going to have to play the entire level again, if not. So we might as well start at the halfway mark. So BRB, I guess. When we're using LE Waterless. Not shooting water at all out of our trunks. Now you want to use her. Screw it. Nice. Because, I mean, honestly, like, this is like the shortest halfway mark in the game, it seems like, because we're already here. I already have Squitter. Might as well not even BRB, honestly. You are a cunt? Well, you can't even get back down. Squitter is dead. Oh, get fucked. But yeah, we're already at the end. So, I just want to try that bonus with two Kongs to see if it works that way. So, now BRB, even though it's short. can't get up there with kitty like that. <laughs> That'd be the only way, but if you had Dixie, you're fucked, so it doesn't matter. 
That's why they gave you that DK barrel. Mm -hmm. Yo. Yo. Okay, he's back. Oh, I know that guy's coming. I want to get through these fuckers, bro. Fuck this. Cause I know you can bounce on them. There you go. Get in the middle. It's just their fucking hitbox. Oh, you can bounce on them too. Cool. Okay, we're back. Ugh. Again, we can show this off some other level as well. But I want to try it. It might kill her though. Yeah, it also makes you fail it, so yeah, never mind. That's awesome. I just want to try it. Oh my god! BRB, because we need both Kongs uh, right there at the end. What the fuck? Ran right into it. I want to try that with Kitty Kong, though, honestly. Would you stop that shit, yo? Alright, let's get up there. There we go. I was like, where is that DK coin? Oh, yes, I remember. Wanna throw it against that. There you go. And let Kitty take all the glory in this episode. Four to nothing. So now let him go against Swanky. And by Swanky, I mean Cranky and Swanky Showdown. As we do race to 25 to see who's the best to get to 25 points first. Let's do it, Cranky. You going against the OP kitty now. Now it's trying to hit the nose. So I missed one. Oh my god, that was so close. There we go. Fast hits, bro. Just guessing it, man. I'm just guessing it. The game knows they're slowing down for me. I'm still losing, though. Holy shit. Oh no, I missed that one. Fuck. Oh boy, that was too close. Two, twice in a row. Did you see my last shot? It went clean through the target. Damn it. It honestly kind of looked that way out of my eye. I don't know about you guys, but let's replay that shit, I guess. I don't mean like, let's do this again. I mean like, let's see an instant replay of that great game now. Alright. So now, we got the chairlifts going. Going through the Rocky Mountain way, through the caves and the mountains. Here in Ropey Rumpus, the final level of World 6. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. I just wanted the bananas, you know me. You know me and my bananas. We already got the first bonus right here. Nice. Okay, nothing's over there. Should have paid attention to that guy. And there's two of them, I knew about that. Bonus is right over here. We see it right there. We're gonna have to blow up the side of the freaking mountain with this TNT. Just grab it and die. <laughs> Me and the bee. All right. It's best if we had Kitty, you know, because he's OP. You know, he's the star of the show. To me, I feel like they're both balanced out. Well, you know, you got someone who's heavy, but has his rolling abilities and. The way he can carry barrels and stuff. Then you have Dixie who can fly and who's lightweight and who can move fast. I like it. So let's do it. Let's do it to it. Alright. We'll run over here, despawn them so they can be at the right spot, and jump all the way to the end there with 66 bear coins. Find the coin. Or, I don't even know what coin number this is going to be. Could be 66. We'll never know. We're getting there, honestly. 
we're gonna keep getting that bear coin though. <laughs> if that's the case. Here we go, here we go, once again. We're about to play this mini game and then lose, but we're not because we are kitty. And we got our 61st coiny. So again, yeah, we are close to 66. I also accidentally did an exploit of this level before on accident by skipping a section. We don't want to go that way first though. Alright, we want to drop down here. Oh, no, we're at the beginning now, shit. Alright, that's cool because there's the DK barrel right here. But yeah, this level's pretty... damn. It's pretty short. Dixie, I wish you could uh, throw that barrel up. That would be nice. And we could have got more bananas, but no. Look what you did to us. Oh shit. I was trying to get the banana, but you know, directional buttons. And we already exploded the TNT, so we can't go back through the bonus. And we don't have our checkpoint, so yay, we get to do that again, anyways. Lovely. So I guess that's what makes this level quote unquote difficult. What the fuck? <laughs> like seriously. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh man, I was really trying to go for it. Whee! 69, just because I wanted the 69. We might as well just do this and drop down. <laughs> Goodbye, bees. Wow. Nice shot, Alex. Really know how to miss. Fuck you. I think it was right there too. It's it. You, you hit one of the bees and you jump all the way up to this other rope and it just skips a little bit of a section of the game. I'm gonna try to show that off here in a second. So BRB, so we can get back there. Yeah, that's what I wanted. That's what I wanted, boys! Oh, I didn't want to drop down there, though. That's what I felt like was going to happen. Fuck that jump. Alright, I wanted to come... Oh my god! Never mind, it wasn't there. It's a little bit later. Suck my ass. Alright, let's fucking get this now, dude. Alright. Alright. We know this is here. This is where it's at. Well, for that. And we go back. That's secret number one. We're getting close to the DK coin. We have to drop somewhere. I forget where, though. It might be further ahead. I could have sworn it's down there somewhere, though, but we'll keep going for now. Because fuck all this part. Pretty sure it's down there, though. Okay, here's the halfway mark. At least we got that. Wow! What a fuck! Nothing down here. Alright, at least we got that. I'm gonna roll off. 
That's the same thing. And it takes us down here. Great. I know there's a drop off area. And it might be later on in the level. We'll never know. I hate that jump out of everything, dude. So that's where we just were when we dropped. It wasn't here where the bananas were. I don't think it's there either. There's a barrel right there that catches you if you fuck up. That's about it. Damn it. It's finding this DK coin. So I know it's up around that area. It's about the only thing I know. Oh my god. Whatever. Well, we're, we're going to be closer to it since we have the halfway mark. That's why this level's not that difficult. Because we're already at the halfway mark right here. Wait, yeah, hold on. Wow, we just did that first try. Yeah, it skips all that and it takes us right there. That's what I meant. That's the I did that on accident once and I was like, man, this level's really short then, because we skipped out on the other shit. But I guess after showing that off, let's just continue. We know there's this fucking bee here now. Thanks for letting me know that. Okay, it might be up this way. It probably is. That whole time we kept dying because I, I was thinking. Oh my god. See, we need Dixie for that. Yep. That's cool. Yeah, it's this way over to the left. There we go. I knew that was there. You don't want to drop too early. <laughs> <laughs> Besides there. If that happens, those bees are fucking fast. Alright. Down here. There he is. That's what I was trying to find. Thank you. It's pretty much just trying to find them. That's the real challenge. Sometimes it's trying to figure out how to hit them. But not always. I don't think we want to drop down there. So let's not. Yay, extra hit. Oh, here we go. This is it. We gotta use this bird. This is the thing that makes the level difficult once again. Secret banana. Let him get all that too. Wanna go backwards. Do I even really want to do that? Shit. Bird would have been able to get the bananas there. Oh, come on, jump, motherfucker. We're just changing the controllers after this episode. I'm telling you. This is it. We got it this time. Have to. Otherwise, the show would be cancelled. But... Let's do this the right way. Without getting hit. Alright. Alright! Okay, that's there. I was about to say, yeah, shoot me right into the bees, please. Make my fucking day. Make my day. You know what, since we got hit, fuck it. Drop down. Takes us back this way. Well... Yeah, there's the still cake. That's that's your shot at glory. Down here, though? Wow, <laughs> they really don't want you to screw up. Alright. Back up. We go. Like a hoe. Like a roly-poly yo. Because we're kitty. And he's the ball of furry. Fury. Alright. Nice. Nice start. 
So we could just go up. You see the banana there. But. Yeah, going backwards, that's harder. But we're going to do it anyways. We did it, but we lost our bird. We don't want to lose the bird at all. So let's do that. I don't know why I did that. We'll just skip that part this time. Get all the extras. Because that... You, this is the level that starts it with that fucking bird. It's not much of a long level to keep him to. Yeah. I just want to fly over you. Easy peasy. Fuck, you get fucked there. So easy. Alright. Yeah, sure, we'll be kitty. Yeah. Watch out for that, please. So it skips those fuckers. That makes everything much easier. Holy shit. Let's do that again. Nice. Yeah, like, I don't know if I desynced them or anything, or if that's literally their cycle. Because that shit sucks. Alright. Wreck shit. I get the bananas. Not you, bird. Just keep going. There you go. He spawns the barrel. So if we fail, we're going to have to start again. Because he's our only way of doing this. And we're fucking kitty for it. We're having sexual relations with a monkey for it. That's exactly what I meant when I said that. No, I use fucking as an adjective. Or actually adverb. Honestly. You son of a bitch! Are you serious? One banana left. Literally one banana left. Literally one banana left. Literally one banana left. I wasn't even that close to you, motherfucker. Fuck these hitboxes. He has the bigger hitbox, too, so it's just like shit. Shit. Yeah, come on. I know what's coming. Let's do it. One shot trot. Yeah, we're going to do it this way. We're going to do it this way. We're going to do it this way. Fuck. Oh, okay. I was trying to go back. I was trying to get the bananas and go back and go through it this way. But, you know. You know. What point am I really trying to prove? It's easy. Alright, cool. So I had the biggest black screen of death. I had to wait a second for our video to get back. We're back. That almost fucked me, because I kept going blindly. But now, obviously we could do this with Kitty. There's no way we should have felt that. So let's do it with Dixie. The better Kong. But in a way, she's too fast. And I feel like these... This is going, like, almost the same fucking order. It seems like, at least at first. But it's okay for her to be this fast. Stop going back and forth. Stay on one side, dude. 
Stop doing this to me. Oh my god. Get out of here, bees. Let's keep going in a circle. I'm gonna break the cycle. Like I just did. We're done. We're finally done. After all that time. Get me the fuck out of here. That's the level. And it takes us here. To the big evil face in the water. Barbosa's bar barrier. To me, the hardest boss in the game. We're playing as on guard to go against this fucker. He's still not that bad. But of all the bosses, this is literally the hardest one. Because look who it is. Our arch nemesis. One of these fucks. One of these fucking urchins. So yeah, uh, you want to use these guys that he's spawning to hit him and hit the purple one. Whichever side you're mostly on, that's where it's going. So since it's on this side, we're going to ricochet this guy. Cool. We want to ricochet this guy. We want to hit him a little sooner than that. There we go. We want to charge up. We don't have to charge up, but I like charging up for this fucker. Big boy urchin. Spiky boy. Let's go. Now we got these homing guys. We got to time it to where they're going to go down and hit those guys. It's kind of hard because they move at the very last second. Like, you can still move them when you think you got them. Okay, we got it. Cool. No more spawns, though. That's the thing. So, that's the second hit. And this is the last phase. Watch out for our spikes. That's all I have to say. Two. Three. Cool. Four. And then you can hit them. So, of course, we, we, we're going to at least die once here. Guaranteed. And at least they start you off here. So, it's not too bad. Cool! Already took a fucking hit. Cool! I'm trying to get the early hits on him. And of course with On Guard being so close with his automatic spray and pray hit. Because the further down they are, you know, they're not going to ricochet all the way from the top and then hit it soon to go down soon, you know. That's the way you want to do it. Yeah, that's definitely not going to work, especially when I moved at the last second. See, he still moves pretty much at the very last second. You want to stay here for a little bit and then move. That's what makes it a little tricky. But I pretty much have the timing down for it. Well, shit, I tried to move. There we go. Take it. So yeah, th that's what makes this boss a bit difficult, movement-wise. This part is honestly the hardest part right here. I tried to move up more because I'm trying to get ready for this hit. Oh my god, and then you hit the top of him. It's very fucking picky. That's the only difficult thing about this boss fight, honestly. So yeah. Enjoy my pain, because we're not cutting any of this out. Even if it's an hour long. Because fuck this. You also gotta get him over on the right side. You want him. But as long as you move on guard over there in time, you should be good. On guardy. On guard day. Come on. Oh, you're getting a little too close to me, buddy. Just a little too close. That's another thing. So just wrap them over here. Yeah, that's... I went a little too slow on that one. Yeah, that angle's pretty sick, but it works. Sick as in... <coughs> you gotta cure that shit. Alright. There's actually a special spot sweet spot where you don't get hit and I think it's like right up here you can actually hit him again yeah we can just wait I think I won't get hit though knew it 
But there you go. That's that's how you can cheese the boss. Make it, make it a lot easier. You can also just go up there and do the triple hit. So I think that's what we're going to do. So BRB. We're actually going to cut there. Speed run. You can also hit the urchin now you don't even if you can like do it right all right well maybe you have to really precise your movement there i i think that works i don't know i could have sworn something like that works oh well. see there's really no point in cutting anything out even though i just said we were come down come back up let him hit once once Oh, come on, dude! Because I'm winding up the final hit. I want to hit him like that. We could we could just... Oh, my God. We could just hit him, dude. It's over. It's literally over right there. Yeah, we're going to have to wait a little bit so you can get at least somewhat of a ricochet off. Apparently. Come on. Let's do it. What the fuck, dude? Yeah. I'm an AIDS carrier. Fuck you. Cool. Cool, I'm glad that worked. Alright. Let's see if this works. Come on, sometimes. You gotta get a little closer. Nice. Yeah, just also depends if you hit them like that, because then they'll move a hell of a lot faster because of the charge hit. Of course, this has to be one of the fucking bosses, right? One of the most annoying ones. And then you have these purple ones. Wish you'd stop giving me the black screen of death, motherfucker. Fucking hate Elgato, bro. We need a new capture card or something. New software device for recording. Come on, I went down a little bit too much. But yeah, these purple ones that don't even open at all. Imagine dealing with that during the game. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'm glad that works. I'm glad that happened. Fuck it, we're just gonna do this legit. We really don't need to. We really don't have to. Oh. My fucking god. We are so close to the end of this. Let's just fucking do it. You dumb fuck. Hate this shit right now. Wow. I'm getting bad spawns. Last one was really good.
Angar hit again because he was closer to the boss. And this is like fucking easy right here though. Like, come on. Hit the protectors. Fuck it. You're dead. It's over. Damn. Three hits. It's over. Finally defeated the boss. There you go. And then we get World pulled out at the very bottom of the drain. And defeating that boss unlocks the castle. Bam. It is now finally open. We pretty much did everything now though. So since we use the wrench, uh, can we like switch back and get the mirror somehow, maybe? Oh, we, we still don't have the wrench. Hey, look at me now, Dixie. Don't you think I'm looking drop dead gorgeous? I'm a lean, mean machine. Well, since he got the mirror now, he looks a lot better. Oh well. We'll probably do that next time. Because, yeah, I guess defeating that sea urchin just unlocks this little passageway for us to now finally get to the castle of Chaos Core. Ooh man, Chaos. I guess we're gonna find him again next time, which technically is the finale, but it's not the grand finale. So we'll see what happens then and what all this means on episode number seven, as this is episode number six. So I'll see you guys then, as we take it on, and we meet Chaos once more.